Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be going to Home Goods and I'm going to be showing you some new home decor finds that include the most beautiful faux trees that I've seen so far, very nice pieces of furniture, table lamps, and home decor in general. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Natalie and every week I take you home decor shopping. Sometimes I bring you inside my house to show you how I decorated by creating decorate with me videos. So if you enjoy that kind of content, I really hope you can consider hitting that red subscribe button down below. And without any further ado, let's just jump right into it. And we are starting with these love seats. And I personally think these are super beautiful. They are probably not that trendy right now, but they have that coastal sense to it. And I do think they have a lot of character to them. These are going to be $400, which is going to be pretty standard pricing for love seats that you may buy at Target. This table right here is $150 and that's on clearance. But one of the stars of the show for today's shopping trip is definitely this faux olive tree right here. This is so beautiful. It is expensive, but size wise, it's so worth the price. This is $150. This tree is taller than me. It comes with a container and it really does look so real. Not only the leaves, but also the branches of the tree, which I thought that was amazing. It looks very high quality, but if you're not into olive trees, then they have this option for you right here. And this one comes in a basket, which is so charming. This is $150. I am on the market for a console table, so of course I couldn't skip this area right here. I'm seeing a lot of options. I do think that some of them are very affordable, but you have to pay attention to the dimensions. Always make sure to measure your space before you invest in a piece of furniture. And to tell you a little story with that, when me and my husband purchased our living room couch, he was convinced that we were gonna need an additional piece because the couch was gonna look small in our family area, but we were looking at the couch in a warehouse, which is where we bought it from, with very tall ceilings, very open spaces, so of course the couch itself was gonna look small. And I convinced him by saying, hey, I think the size it is, it's gonna be perfect. If we think it's too small, we can always get the additional piece. But for now, let's start with this. Spoiler alert, I was right. The couch fit perfectly in, its, in our space. But why am I telling you all of this? So look at this console table right here. This is so beautiful and so affordable, but it has an issue. This console table is so short. So if you put it on a wall, it's probably going to be right above your knees. That is really not ideal. You can see a taller version of that console table right there. So all I wanted to say, or just to summarize my point, pay attention to your dimensions, pay attention to the size of your space and the proportion. But speaking about console tables, this one right here has my heart. The only thing I don't like is the angle on the legs of the table, but I love the finish, I love the color. Also, the drawers don't have any kind of hardware, but they do slide pretty smooth, so that is a plus. Can we also talk about this mirror right here? It's so beautiful and it's super massive in size, which is awesome because it's perfect to have it right around you get dressed to look your outfit or you can definitely place it in the entrance of a house because it is a piece that can provide a lot of character to your area that one is 250 dollars i also found this console table right here this one has kind of that oval shape it has a combination of wood and black metal which is very very trendy right now for 180 dollars and you have two shelves which will provide a little bit more room to decorate mm -hmm. 
This section right here is the one you see right as you enter my local home goods, and usually they place the cutest seasonal decorations in there. So I thought on sharing this area with you. This is a very nice patio set. It's a three piece patio set. You can use it in your front porch or back porch. I was trying to get you the price right there. The material for the chairs is something I'm not too fond of only because it can be very fragile to have it on the outdoors. However, this set is $150. I believe that's the price for the set of the three pieces, which if it is, then that's a great deal. This tray right here was another beauty, and this one is $30. It's a super large and sturdy piece as well. Now in here, I found these very crafty baskets. I, I think they're crafty because of the detail they have on the edge of the basket per se. It has a very organic, non-tinted color in the straw material, which makes it very rustic, yet very beautiful. You can definitely incorporate this in different styles of decor. And the smaller one is $14.99, the largest one is $16.99. So for $2, it's better to get the largest one, definitely. Then I found this very modern vase, which you may think it's glass, but it's actually plastic. I wasn't too crazy about it, only because of that. But this vase behind looks or seems to be very heavy and sturdy, which is what I prefer. It's very beautiful. I just didn't like the finishes and the metal around the handles of that vase. I couldn't find a price for that one either. It just wasn't labeled. Then this little fish wood tray is so cute for $16.99. Great for any entryway table, console table. And if you are into that beachy or coastal style of decor, this one right here looks beautiful in that gorgeous, dark brass collar and in my opinion this is not too expensive for twelve dollars you can use this as a bowl a decorative bowl or a functional one to hold your keys whenever you come inside your house in a whole different Then this tray right here, I thought it was really beautiful. It's very light in weight. It's all wooden and it has the metal handles. No price for that one, so I do apologize. This very eclectic piece of decor is one that was also placed in this section for $14.99. I don't know how I feel about it. I guess it looks beautiful, but it's just not my color, the red, if you know what I mean. This beaded garland can be very popular and can complement any space that you are decorating for $12.99. I found this gorgeous oversized wooden chain that you're going to see here, and this one is $35. But the good thing about these kinds of decorations is that they are so oversized that you really don't need much along with it to decorate a table. And you know, at the end of the day, it ends up being a little bit more cost efficient. You end up buying less decorations. And I think that actually looks very, very good. In here, I have some coastal vases. They have a combination of blue and green. Some of them are going to be on clearance, like that one right there for $14. But this one right here, I thought it was absolutely adorable. That is if you really like a coastal style of decor that screams beach, which is possible if you live by the beach or if you really like the beach. And that piece, I thought it was really, really nice. Down here, just a bunch of random pieces, but I did pick up this sphere, which is aged and beautiful, and it was only $5 on clearance. So that right there is an amazing deal. This face right here, I'm not too fond of the color combination, but I think it has so much potential if you would buy it on clearance and repaint it yourself. I think the shape is beautiful. This one right here, I don't think it was labeled either, or maybe it was, yes it is, and that one is $20. But this one is textured, so you really can't paint over it.
Then I found these oversized vases for $25. The good thing about these is that you can place them straight on the floor if they are proportional to your walls and your ceilings. You can combine them with another vase that's a different size or maybe some lanterns and you have already a corner decorated without the need of any furniture. Then this very modern yet eclectic looking vase in that really pale sage green color for $25 is everything to combine with some dry eucalyptus. And then this figure right here, it looks like it's marble, but it's really not and it's on clearance. Okay, now I'm going to jump back into the furniture because I found these benches. I'm also in the market for these, or at least I love seeing them. I think they're great for an entryway area that you have. It's great to place one just to sit down and take off your shoes or put on your shoes. It's also great to have them in bedrooms in front of a queen size or full size or even king size bed and they add such a nice cozy look to it for some reason, I don't know, I love them. This one right here is one of my favorites that I saw on this day. It is wood and it has the straw top which adds such a modern look to it, even mid-century modern for $130. Then this one is actually my favorite. I love the combination of the fabric with the dark wood. I think it looks so elegant and I think it's super versatile to so many different styles. This one, I, I'm not sure it was labeled with a price tag, but if you're not interested in white fabric, especially on places where you're going to be sitting down, then they have these right here that are all wood. This is really high up in the store, so I was lifting my camera to be able to give you a peek on the top of that bench and that one is also going to be $130. This lamp right here, I don't know why, it reminds me of Studio McGee. It is so pretty. The only thing is that it was so high up in the store and it was the only one they had, but the price is $40, which is going to be cheaper than a Studio McGee lamp at Target. Usually those will retail for about $60 and more. But in here, I found some very nice finds for table lamps. If you don't think anything will interest you here, stay tuned because there are some hidden gems in this area. So I'm gonna start with these very classic, shabby chic, even farmhouse looking table lamps. The largest ones are $60, there are smaller ones for $17 as well, and the smaller ones can be very useful if you have a small room with not a lot of space but you want to add a table lamp. Then these right here are quite eclectic. They are, I don't even know how to describe them, but the shades, I can't even describe the material. I've never seen anything like this. This is something that you can buy and put in your house and nobody is going to believe that you got it from Home Goods because it looks so peculiar that it looks like it came out from a designer. Even though I don't love these lamps, they do have a very different look to them. And I don't know if you were able to see, but prices for those are between $80 to $100. So definitely on the pricey side. Then I found these lamps. These are also very, very cute. I just don't love the shape of the shade. But these are also on the very pricey side. They are $120, which equals buying two lamps from Target. So if you're going to invest in one of these, it's better that you like the shade and you don't plan to change it, if you know what I mean. Okay, moving along these right here, I think these are so pretty for a coastal style of decor. The only thing about these is that they're smaller. They're $40 each. The base is ceramic. And then Home Goods also has these for $40 in all colors. I show you the green and they also have that beautiful pastel pink right there, which will be nice for a girl's room for decor. They also have very nice modern options like this one right here for $30, which is way more affordable. And then these, I really do not cover all that much in my channel, but I saw them there and they are $100 each. They, of course, are going to vary in prices depending on what you like. Oh, 
it back again Cause we had love enough A bit of time A bit of love then in this section, the first thing that caught my eye was those rattan lamps you're seeing in the center with that gorgeous shade. These are actually a dupe for the Studio McGee collection for spring this year at Target. The only thing is that these are no cheaper. I mean, these are $60. I think that's how much those lamps are as well. So it's gonna depend on which lamp do you like better. But these fans, I thought they were super nice and cute. If you have a gym at home, you can buy one of these, put them there while you work out. And they have different colors. They have silver, brass, and I believe they have white as well for those fans. And we have made it to the end of the video. Thank you so, so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section down below what was your favorite item that I share with you today. If you enjoyed this video, I really hope you can consider subscribing and I really hope I can see you in my next one. Bye. I'm out of reasons, I'm out of rhyme, but I'll only tell you that I'm out of time. I'm sick of love songs, I'm tired of this, and I want to tell you straight just like it.